We'll see you on our next Raptor Adventure. What's going on adventurers? Welcome to Ohana. We've actually dined in Ohana and brought you with us previously, but tonight we are going to be having dinner. So, are you ready for it? I am ready. Me too. I'm really hungry. It's 9 o'clock. I'm pretty sure tonight it's the last seating for dinner. So, we're going to go on in and we are going to share our experience with you. All right, guys, so we just got seated at our table here in Ohana, and we just placed an order. Um, we actually, Lisa actually has some sensitivities to different seasonings, so the chef came out and was very glad to accommodate her. I'm actually going to have the same thing as her so that she doesn't feel left out. But I am going to try the appetizers. Um, I believe it's chicken wings, and those are marinated as, uh, and seasoned as well. I'm going to go ahead and try them the way they are. Um, they brought us some delicious bread out, and we did order some alcohol beverages this evening. I got a traditional pina colada. Um, it's kind of a pina colada kind of day. And Lise got, what was it called? The raspberry uh, pina colada. Uh, it does have another name. I have to ask. Okay. But at any rate, it has raspberries yeah. in it. And it looked quite delicious. So we are going to show you things as they come out. We did get a, a nice window seat, but due to the humidity outside, there's condensation on the window, so you guys can't really see out. All right, guys, so this is the salad, and I believe you said it had a honey lime vinaigrette, which sounds very refreshing. We're going to go ahead and enjoy our salad and let you know how it is. The bread, by the way, is a coconut bread with regular butter, and it's delicious, as you can see. Here are our pina coladas. There's mine. Let me see yours. Cheers. Cheers. Aloha. Aloha. The salad is excellent, you guys. It it kind of resembles a kale, but. It's a lot more tender than a kale, so I'm not sure. So they just brought us out a delicious skillet, which has pop stickers, chicken wings, some lo mein noodles, and some vegetables. Already got a plate full. I've tried the pop sticker so far, and it's really good. What have you tried? Pop sticker. That's the first thing you tried? Yeah. They are really good. You try anything else yet? Um, the broccoli is good. Vegetable. Awesome. All right. I will keep you guys posted, but so far, so good. Enjoying it thoroughly. So here is the beef that the chef was so nice to accommodate us with. It just has simple salt and pepper on it, uh, no other seasonings, no other sauces. The usual beef is marinated as well as the chicken. Here is the chicken, and that is plain as well, and everything looks so delicious. Cannot wait to try it. You look pretty happy. Let me see you. Okay guys, so Lise does have a shellfish allergy unfortunately quite recent actually but um they did go ahead and bring me out some shrimp and look at the size of that platter i'm already getting full like this food is so good but so filling because i've eaten so much of it everything is delicious though i have no complaints about anything how about you no very good yeah everything's excellent and it kind of all goes together as well, like you can mix and match kind of each skill that I think. Yeah, it just everything complements each other. So they even brought us a nice steaming hot towel to wipe our fingers from all the stickiness. Ooh, it's hot. Oh my gosh, look at that steam. Ooh, that's hot. 
I feel like I'm getting a facial at the same time. Oh, that's hot. My hands feel very, very clean. Of course, the best part, the banana bread pudding is getting ready to come out. I did tell him that we were only a little bit hungry for dessert, only because we're so stuffed already. So, I have to say guys, the pina colada, this was the best pina colada I think I've ever had in my life. Me too. Really? Keep that in mind if you're a pina colada fan. I did it right here, whatever they did, it was perfect. Yeah, it was great. I had one at the Grand earlier and it was not as good. They definitely don't, they definitely don't skimp on the alcohol here either. So, we will show you when the banana bread pudding comes out. And then we will be on our way for the evening because I'm pretty tired. It's been a long day, guys. We had to transfer from Bay Lake Tower today to the Poly. And imagine my surprise when we were able to get an Ohana reservation for tonight, the day of. I was super stoked. Here it is, guys. The piece de resistance. The, I think he said pineapple bread pudding with the banana sauce. Lisa's gonna do us the honor. Oh, that's what I'm talking about right there. Looks so good. Yes. Let's see. It's like a butterscotch. Butterscotch. It's probably like a banana butterscotch. It tastes like a butterscotch. All right, guys. So we thoroughly enjoyed our dinner at Ohana. It's been way too long since we've had dinner here, and I have a feeling it won't be too long till we're back. It was delicious. It really was. <laughs> and my compliments to the chef for accommodating our allergy sensitivities. Um, if you have any dietary concerns uh, regarding allergies, just be sure that you aren't afraid to speak up because they're so happy to accommodate you. They want you to enjoy your meal here at Disney. So with that being said, we'll see you on our next Raptor Adventure.